all that is this video and I'd like to do a quick prize pack unboxing. I won a giveaway on Instagram on Crystal Overby's um, Instagram page. It's Overby Designs. I think in the past I said over by designs. But I didn't know back then that that was her last name. I'm sorry, girl. But I'm pretty sure it's Overby Designs. Um, so go check her out. She's also, also on YouTube. Um, I don't remember entering the giveaway when I found out that I had won. Um, it's not because I don't care. It's because I am forgetful. And I'm whispering because people is asleep up in here. Okay. So apparently her version of a pocket letter fits in a medium... <laughs> flat rate box. <laughs> so I'm just trying to crack into that real fast. Um, yeah. So that's the slashing you guys are hearing. She's in a lot more than just a pocket letter, so I'm just gonna start taking stuff out and put it on the table. Oh my god, that's so cute! Is this for Dollar Tree? I don't think I've seen that. That's okay, let me just keep going. Mmm, fun little dip mix. <laughs> that's a cute little packaging idea. Whoa, what did you do here? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I am very... <gasps> what did you send? This is not in an envelope. <gasps> okay. Okay. Um, Oh my gosh, what does she say? Amak, 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 what does she say? And then she gets punched in the stomach. <laughs> it's a hope gets hope, hocus pocus pig. Oh my god. Something good is my time, something like that, right? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Okay, if any of this is falling apart, I am sorry. Oh no, don't fall, don't fall. Take it easy, take it easy. Holy cannoli. This is the pocket letter. So I'm going to leave this to the end. <laughs> oh, where'd you come from, little critter? Where are you supposed to go? Hmm, hmm. Investigate. Hmm. I'll figure it out. I'll figure out where you go, little guy. Okay, hold on. she went way overboard and you shouldn't have but I thank you anyway <laughs> I don't want to seem like grateful when I get after people for doing too much but um yeah let me just get started let's get it started <laughs> this is such a cool ephemera piece where'd you get this from um but it's a like anatomical type of little map or something Not a, I guess of a skeleton I don't know what I'm saying in a coffin shape that is so cool it's like you, she backed it up on some black um, paper. And here's a tag. It's like a fence of some sort with a fleur de lis. So cool. Did you print these out and then like back them up yourself? And then here's a skeleton in a top hat tag. And here are a bunch of 31 little banner circle numbers here. A bat banner. It's really pretty. And then here's another one with a pumpkin in the middle. I really like that, the mix of the 
the print, you know, the papers, and then the image. Really cool. Thank you. That is so cool. Okay. And then like I showed you guys, the first thing I got out was this. It has a little thing pushed in. Oh, cool. Look, it has a... Oh, it's a color changing. So cool. The calavera. That is so cool and it's so pretty. I like the purple color. Put it back in so... So cute. You can hang out back here. <coughs> there you go. And then she has these little like um, dip containers or you know dressing containers and then she punched out or cut out a, a circle and then it put a jack-o-lantern sticker. Really cute packaging. And then she put this sequence mix. Oh, I don't have any orange kitties. Or some of these ghosties just look like ghosties, ghosties. Those are so cute. Thank you. Where did you get this mix from? Or you probably made it yourself, but maybe Allie? I don't know. But it's really cute. I like the colors, and I like the different shapes. And the different colors of each shape. Very nice. Thank you. Nope, nope. Oh, there it goes static. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Let's close it up before they stick to me again. <laughs> When I'm putting, you know, sequins away from Allie's and I'm trying to put it away. And then it ends up sticking to me. Oh, it's a long night when that happens. So here's another soccer, soccer circle. Cut out, punch out. And then a bat. Really cute. I like that paper. The houses with the different colored lights inside. And then some pants. Hmm, are you trying to make me do something? Just kidding. Very pretty white and black Push pins, I guess. I think that's what they're called. Thank you very much. And then maybe this is a clue. And then this one has the different poison and potion bottles. It says Witch's Brew. Extra fine quality. Really pretty sticker. And then there are a bunch of bad eyes. Just kidding. There are a bunch of seed beads that are clear, but then they have either purple or black in the middle. Do you see that? are really pretty. Thank you. Very nice extras. Too many extras if you ask me. What did she say? Amok, amok, amok. I think that's what she says. But that is really pretty. Um, she has this little wand. It has, it's like a, a pumpkin pick, a purple one with some like gold or orange you know, accents right here, and it says Happy Halloween, little flag right there, and then this really pretty ribbon, where did you get this from, there's a store online, I, I remember looking for a certain kind of ribbon on there, but I never ordered, I don't know if I found that website through you or not, but there's some purple glitter ribbon trim, and some purple tool, that is so cute, oh, and then this one too, really pretty, like a lavender trim as well and a black and white twine. I like that mix of um, ribbon trim and whatnot. Really beautiful pick. Thank you. Or wand pick. Mm, I don't know. Don't don't judge me for my lack of terminological. I'm just gonna stop right there and just keep going. <laughs> she got me this really cute wooden piece that says wicked on it. I love the lettering. Really cute. And the, the paint on it, really nice. Just enough color. Really cute. Okay, now let me check in this one. She has googly eyes. Oh, so cool. Okay, so she got me some pom-poms that have the spinies. I like those. They're so cute. And then... Oh, let me see. There are some spider webs. Ooh, glittery spider web. So cute. Really nice. Thank you. And then she got me some googly eyes. That's what I heard. There were some googly eyes. Oh my gosh, look. There, okay, there's some more spiny weed um, pom poms with some googly eyes. Really cute. And then she got me these chipboard. Phrases, an uninvited guest. In memory of an, an uninvited guest. Boo. 
<laughs> That's a cute start to a to a short story, right? Those are really cute and really thick. Thank you. I don't know where to find those things. Then again, the other day I was looking and I have like Tim Holtz, some kind of like, I thought they were like little phrases like this. Well, they are like, actually. I thought it was just going to be like, boo, blah, blah, blah. No, but it says like, they're actual like little phrases, more like this. I was like, oh, okay. So I need to incorporate that into my Halloween making. And then these bottles, I can tell she offered in. Ooh, interesting. So she painted this one, it looks like. I don't know what's in there. It says Eye of Newt. I don't know if it's just supposed to be. Um, I don't know. Mine up. Maybe I shouldn't open it. I'm just not going to open it. And then you can tell me if I should or not. But she has a googly eye on top. I think it's just supposed to be cutesy. Right? Hold on. No, I'm not going to open it. You let me know if I'm supposed to open it or not. Maybe it's just supposed to be like a decoration, you know? So I have Newton, there's a bunch of googly eyes all over it. Uh, she painted it black, and then she put a black tool or purple tool over it. And made a little navel. Navel. <laughs> Label, sorry. Really cute. And then this one. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think they're supposed to be open. This one says dried warts <laughs> with the picture of a... Um, a witch right there and then she has did you do this with a glue gun maybe oh wow so she has like spider webs and a spider and stuff and then she painted it really cute little um decor pieces um, 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 um. okay so in this one she has this cute background paper first of all very pretty stars, kind of, you know, vintaged out a little. And then in here, oh my goodness, girl, what did you send me? This really pretty um, ribbon. Is it cross grain, cross grain, cross fit? I never remember what it's called, but it has the spider webs. Oh, so cute. I love that. And then this really adorable look. Little witchies and the little were, were child. <laughs> And then the little mummy. That is so cute. Thank you. Oh my gosh. And then she sent me this trim. This is like a like a mum, 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 gunmetal trim right here. Really nice. And then this one right here is the sequence. Also, it looks, I don't know if it's black or gunmetal. I can't tell in this poor lighting of mine. But thank you so much. Quite a bit, a good amount of both. Thank you. And then she also sent me a crud ton of this black lace. Yeah. I love it. So pretty. You guys see that? Very nice. Thank you so much. Wow, wow, wow. This is a lot more than just a price pack, girl. I just don't want to um, misplace this ribbon because my kitty will get to it, will enjoy it, and probably will chew it up if I don't put it back. Okay. Um, let's go with this one. Oh my gosh. Did I get everything over there? Yes, I did. So this one, oh, I like this background paper also really nice i haven't seen any of these papers before so look at this it's like vintage looking um witch on her broomstick with the kitty cat and then the moon and the bats and bats flying around those are kitty cat prints oh my gosh that's so cute i love it okay so then she sent me some rosettes wow look at this it's like a mesh glittered mesh type of a tool or something or other and then she made it into a large um, rosette and then she used black um, what's this called how long you've been talking about it <laughs> cheater streamer cray paper <laughs> um, and then she used some silver like paint and then she used like black or silver stars so pretty 
and then she used the piece of paper rack here in the background and then this one of the haunted house with the, the dead tree with the bats in the crescent moon it says check in here reservations reservations check in here check out never <gasps> hotel california okay then she made another rosette with crepe paper as well with some of the you know spooky stuff what's it called hold on oh, creepy cloth and some wow where do you get all these different kinds of like mesh it's like white with iridescent glitter and then there's this cute paper in the background with the kitty cat face wow. and then it says eek so cute and then this rosette crepe paper again with this beautiful little doily i don't know where you guys get all these doilies probably alley let me know please it's witching hour with this awesome dimensional dimensional sticker with the witch on top i like them so much i love them even the background paper is amazing. Thank you so much. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you. This, you know, stuff like this, adding like the mesh like that, um, inspires me to change up my making too. Okay, so I did all those. So I'm going to do this one. This one's kind of heavy. So it's, um, I think this is from Dollar Tree. It's like a canvas bag with this really pretty, pretty, I guess, multi-chrome uh, purple band on the bottom. And then it looks like a, um, I guess it could be like a skeleton-ish face head um, cut out of um, glittered felt. And then these really beautiful flowers, roses. These are actually, I believe, from Dollar Tree. I oh look she put a gemmy inside of that really pretty I believe they're from Dollar Tree um I hauled some but I haven't recorded that yet <laughs> anyway and then she what did you put <gasps> okay that one scared me I looked in there and that scared me <laughs> that is a really pretty and scary purple spider if you start crawling away I'm gonna scream bloody murder okay and then in here This is what's so heavy. Look, it's a big giant key. That is so beautiful. Thank you so much. Oh wow, that's like for real a key. It says alter me, collect me, display me, share me. The choice is yours. Enjoy. Uh hoarding. <laughs> no, I'm really gonna display. This is beautiful. And it says 31. Happy Halloween. Really beautiful. Oh my gosh. This right here could have been the price and I would have been like ecstatic. Thank you so much. And then what else did you send me? Let me see. Oh wow, look, it's that the witch in the background. Or the witch in the circles. I believe these are cards, yep really pretty paper different you know shades of orange in there with the black and then oh look at this one i like this one it's very vintage with the ghosties look at the breaking it down <laughs> with the bats so cute and then here are some what are they doing a funky dance there <laughs> some ghosties with the black background and then oh i love this paper so much with the kitty and the kitty paw prints oh, i love it i love it Oh my gosh, look at this one. This is Halloween greetings with the two black heads about to ding ding about to go um get into a cat fight. Halloween greeting. <laughs> Halloween. That is so cool. Oh look, there's an owl with the kitty and the witches and the pumpkin. These are so beautiful. Thank you. These papers are awesome. And then she sent me cards. Thank you so much. Okay, let me put this away. Okie dokie, okie dokie. Let me put this away before I lose it. And this one too, the <coughs> kitties will love this string. And I need to put this away before, um, they get to it. Okay, so I'm going to move your tube back here. 
you two little guys. Wait, is this metal? I mean, no, this is glass. Maybe. I don't know. Obviously, I said metal when I meant glass, so unfortunately. Wow, you really, like, outdid yourself. She was really excited about making um, the prize pack. There was another winner, winner, winner as well. And, um, so I don't know if that other lady has it. I can't remember if she has a YouTube, so I'm not sure. Okay. And here is the loaded envelope. Oh my goodness, guys. Okay, hold on. Don't mind the sound of the random plastic bags. That has nothing to do with the crap that's around my feet. Just kidding. Uh, it's just my trash bag that fell. Okay, so this is a beautiful shaker. Oh my gosh. I really love the way you constructed this. So there's a shaker, and it has a bunch of awesome shaky. Oh, look at this. Who? Oh my god, where was it? Where was it? Come on, come on, come on. Yes, it was from the embellishment swap, I believe. Oh my gosh. I believe that's the only thing that I recorded today that had. Yes, yes, it was from the embellishment swap from Tony Craft Prayer J Girl, uh, from her first embellishment swap. Um, somebody, I can't remember which of the three ladies in my group, I'm so sorry ladies, but um, one of them had put seed beads in her, um, in the mix that she made for us, and I had never seen that in person. I had seen it like online or whatever, but it looks so much cooler in person, I think. So she used sequins. Oh, look at the score really cool with those little CDs she sent me so now I know that's what I can use it for for sure that's what I was thinking but now I can see it's really cool this is happy haunting I believe it's my mind's eye collection I love the look of that paper with the little crow or raven nevermore so sorry <laughs> who's hungry not me my stomach says yeah me anyway <laughs> so embarrassing I can't restart this I need to keep going Okay, so then there's like a banner in the background with, again, that, um, what's it called? Mesh, I believe, with the iridescent glitter. And then here is this witch. Did you do this yourself? That is really cool. Like a silver witch. That is so cool. And then she used, like, different twine and whatnot. I don't know if she had it like that already or she, like, inked it up. And then she has some glitter all around it as well. Really cool. Thank you so much. And then I'm going to unload, well, kind of look at the pocket like this with you guys. And then I'll unload it so then we can admire it. Holy hell. That's from a movie, guys. Okay, anyway. It's a double-sided. It's a double wide. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so we're going to do this side first. Okay, so here in the bottom, she has this adorable rosette. I love is this a die cut that you used or did you cut it beforehand before you made the rosette? But either way, she used this really pretty, almost like a jelly looking kind of glitter. Really pretty purple with this um, owl's head that has the jammies for the eyes. Really beautiful. And then she made these witch's brooms. They are so cool looking. So it's like a black stick or a straw or something that she painted with the jammies. And then the paper on the bottom with the twine right here and then she has a little skull on top with oh is this the how use the push pins maybe and it looks like they have like little hats or something on that is really cute ghosts and goblins spooks galore excuse me which is knocking at your door jack-o-lantern shining bright wishing you a haunting night that is so cool oh my gosh and look at the trim she used on the bottom here with that really angry uh, owl paper in the background I love how it's all tiny in. Oh, look, guys, she's sending my own. She sent me four. I don't want to. Okay, so she sent me four brooms. This one has a witch's glitter like button hat right there, um, and then this one has the twine. This one has twine too, and then it has um, the purple swirled glitter right there. And here they all have jammies with twine, and this one has orange jammies 
with, like I said, orange and white twine here. This one has a black with purple glitter star. And this one has another little skull with the swirled glitter. Those are so cool. And the paper background is so cool, too. Thank you so much. Oh, my Lanta. That is so cool and kind of scary, too. Okay, so the background paper... That is so haunting and so cool. I can't like make anything out and that's what makes it extra like haunting. Like I can tell that's a foot, I think. Wow, okay. And then so she like layered it. There's paper on either side and there's something in between layered. And look at this spooky witch. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. Can you guys see that? And then she used some of that. I believe it's Dollar Tree um, ribbon. And I love it because the glitter doesn't come off, right? Like, I think that was just from other stuff. I can't check. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, it's really cool. And then she distressed the edges with the purple. So cool. Thank you so much. And then, what is this? Hold on. Okay, that's the pocket. This one in here. Oh, she put like a button or something. It says Book of Spells. See that right there? That's really cool. And then she sent me, oh wow, look at this. She sent me a silicone necklace with, <laughs> that is such a cute owl with like a crackled um, pink stone perched on a little branch with like a ruby colored gem right there. That is so cute. And then the eyes are black gems. That is so adorable. That is so pretty. And I love background paper too. That is so cool. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, wow, wow. Okay. So then this part right here is um, a spider web with this giant spider. Oh, you're not real, right? <laughs> and then she made, uh, she put some glitter back here and some on the tips as well. And it says, Bewitch the Mind. Right here. This little banner, oh, that is so pretty. I love the color of that. And then there are two bats flanking that right there. And, oh my gosh, look at this. Wow, look at this dangle. Oh, this is scary. <laughs> uh, so has, she has this keychain type thing right here. And then she has this, um, it, yeah, it smells, it tastes, not taste, it smells like cinnamon, this little broom. And then she has it wrapped right here with that ribbon. And she has another charm right here. And there's a heart, some kind of like a wreath, and then a key. That is so cool. Thank you so much. And then right here, she gave me some hot pink alphas. And then she made a back topper with this like moth paper and a purple butterfly. Thank you so much. I don't have anything like that. I think these are sticko. My face. I don't know why. I don't know what I'm talking about. Never mind. I don't know what it is. And it doesn't matter. I like it. And so this right here. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. They're like different sayings. Best regards. Bon voyage. Thanks so much. Good for you. Really cool. Thank you. And then this really pretty back topper with that really nice vintage star paper and then happy haunting banner. Thank you so much. Okay. As if that wasn't more than enough. Mirror them. Okay. <laughs> she has the back side to it. Calling all witches. <laughs> That's really cute. Okay, so then she has that lace trim right here as well. And then down on the bottom. And this is so cute. This looks like a little witch's like apron and skirt with a little bow out of crepe paper. And look, her little legs are curled up. That is so cute. Her leggings are the house paper and then little boots that have been glittered up that is so cute so right here she made me oh look she made some different bows here this one has like some and they're like material um happy halloween spooky and then the little ghosties wearing witches hats and then she made me three little ones with um um, um, um spider web um material those are so cute thank you Thank you so much. And then this, 
Okay, I hate that. And then this is a really pretty witch's hat with um, the spider web again, and it's like really thicked up. And then it has the band right here with the really pretty gem. You see that? I'd like a gem buckle. And then this really pretty uh, floral sticker. And again, the Call Me All Witches. Oh my gosh, this, this is just the empty pocket letter, but it is so beautiful just by itself. Like the way she decorated it is amazing. Thank you so much. This is like way too. So thank you so much. I don't even remember how everything went in. I'll figure that out later. So, ah, uh, look at this prize pack. Okay, you need to go away because you scare me. If I see you, if my cats come up here and see them like that, forget it. <laughs> I will see you later. But thank you so much, Crystal. Oh my gosh. This is way more than I, I was, first of all, just hearing that I won was amazing. And then, um, she started giving sneak peeks on Instagram of the different things. And I was like, <gasps> and secretly I was like, oh yeah, I kind of wish that's mine. <laughs> I hope that's mine. But yeah, she sent some amazing, amazing prizes. Um, I love the shape though. That is so cool. And just all the different elements, the detail that she put into everything. Wait, did I not see this? Did this fall out? I don't think I saw this. <laughs> Part 5. Okay, so here's a rosette with a, a really pretty, uh, like the spider ring with the purple tool in the background. And then here's just the reverse of that. Those are so pretty, see? I just totally missed <laughs> So obviously, her intention detail was much greater than mine because I didn't pay attention. Or not that I didn't pay attention, but I totally missed that. I think it fell out maybe when I pulled it out. I don't know, but yeah, like all these things are so amazingly made. And the detail and the little additions and extras are so cool. And then this little guy, I don't know where he went, but he's so cute. We'll figure it out. So yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Um, go check her Instagram out and her YouTube channel. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you, Crystal, again for my prize pack. It's so amazing. I can't wait to look through it again and play with it. And, um, yeah, use some of these goodies, too. And haul the rest. <laughs> so, uh, not haul. Hoard the rest. <laughs> thank you guys so, so much for watching. Bye.